I just got to start out and say this. I was wrong. I was so, so wrong about these Crimson Vow set booster boxes being like these cool, like God kind of boxes with the showcase cards. Well, you can have all the showcase cards you want in the world, but if they're not, <laughs> hey buddy, how you doing? How you doing? Are you shy? You want to say hi? You want to say hi? <laughs> You're so cute. Okay, I daddy gotta finish this, okay? Um, you could have all the showcase cards you want uh, in the world, but if they're not worth anything, if there's not much value to them, who the heck cares? So there's some crazy big distribution, uh, you know, problem going on with Wizards of the Coast. Uh, I guess a lot of customers are really upset with this. And these boxes, I'm gonna tally up, I'm gonna tally up all the value in this, and you are going to see what exactly these crazy, what I thought godlike showcase boxes uh, actually are worth. And you're you're gonna be your head's gonna spin. Wait till you see me tally up these cards. Check this out. I was wrong. I was dead wrong. Yeah, dude. Yeah, dude. Yeah, dude. Scottish dude. We're going back to this, bro. Hey, guys. This is box five of six from a sealed case. And guess what? You're in for a treat. You are. Who is you? That's right. You are. You are in for a really big treat. You know why? Because we got a set booster box that is freaking loaded. With showcase cards, impossible, crazy number of mythics. <clears throat> Box five of six. You won't see nothing like this, man, anywhere else. Are you ready? This is gonna this is gonna turn your frown upside down when you're opening your box. You know why? Because you're not gonna get anything freaking close to the power of this. It, or the value. It's just insane. This is not normal. What you're about to experience, this is box five of six, sealed case that I already know is gonna be juiced to the to the moose. Okay. Let's go. Watch this. Watch this. Showcase card. Guaranteed. <laughs> Here we go. Yeah, I already see it. it I already freaking see it. Right off ripples. There we go. Here we go. Speaking of ripple, hot dogs. All right. Bam. Overlord. Jacob. What's up? Dude, I I, I don't pull anything out there than Jacob. Look, look at this pack. One rare, one mythic, one rare foil. <laughs> Not bad. Not a bad way to start your day, you know what I mean, huh? You guys know? You don't? You don't? Okay. That's going to go here. All right, watch this. This is nothing but showcase in the freaking wear slot. With the exception of maybe about three, four packs, tops. And usually it's going to be a mythic in this slot. Bam, Dorothea. There you go, baby. It's freaking weird. Never seen nothing like this before. Never seen nothing like this before. Huge shout out, man. Ground zero comics that's where i got this case that's where we're cracking this case it's just nutty it's freaking nuts watch this bam we already got a hundred runos why not another old nut stain dude showing up in the foil props dude thank you that is a sweet looking card man them foils e-e-a beautiful let's keep it going foil mountain Whoops. Gotta put you in the foil pile, pal. There you go. Gotta put you in the foil pile, pal. Say that four times fast. How pack. <laughs> Excuse me. How pack, Piper. Uh, you are not. Um, see, that's an exception. You are not a showcase there. Good card. I wouldn't complain if I crack a how pack, Piper, in a pack, man. That's some good, uh, that's some good heat, you know? All right. Let's find them golds. Ready? Watch this big one. <laughs> more progenitor how does he know this every time all right we got more progenitor and it's mythicness dude that guy he's a boss he's a boss he is a freaking boss he's the moss boss all right right up here bam another mythic we'll take it there's a bloodcaster and scavenger weird so weird because i already know we're gonna pull a bunch of more bloodcasters and uh the alternate, like, van our showcase or vampire art, you know, whatever it is. <clears throat> I already know it. It's going down. Sink, sink. <sighs> Purveyor. With Guardian of Throbbing. Good. I like seeing her. Oh, my God. Triple showcase freaking pack. I was hoping for a quad. We pulled Purveyor, Guardian of Throbbing, 
Charmed groom in one pack. Shut up. Shut up. <clears throat> Can't make this stuff up. Cannot make this crap up, man. All right, let's go. <clears throat> this is insanity. And just, like, there's so many showcase cards regardless. Like, we're just getting showcase after showcase after Mythic, Faithbound Judge. Foil Gargantua. You know we haven't pulled? We have not pulled one of these yet. A list card. We haven't pulled a single list card. That's kind of weird. That is, you know what? That is kind of weird, though. That's really freaking weird. We haven't pulled a list card yet. There's Catilda. Cool. Blood Surveyor. No list card. Wow. They're probably... Uh, they're probably waiting to give us something really good. There's one in every four packs, and we're already, what, six, seven in? <clears throat> kind of weird. I mean, not going to lie. It's kind of a little, little strange. I'm not getting worried about it, but Bloodcaster. We got the Recluse. There you go, Moonlace. Target, spell, or permanent becomes colorless. There you have it, baby. <laughs> That's pretty hot. We pulled a freaking Moonlace. All right, nice pull there. Cabbage. Nice pull off the freaking list. All right, guys. All right, guys, you ready? Are you ready? What did you have to eat today? Go. What did you have to eat? I had another peanut butter and jelly sandwich. I'm not going to lie. I'm recording this video right after I recorded the other one. So. <laughs> I had a peanut butter and jelly freaking sandwich today. Why is my thumb yellow? You see that? I don't know what's going on there. Damn Cheetos. No, I'm, no I swear it's not from Cheetos. I know I know what it's from. Uh, Brian Comer, nothing bad. Um... What did you have to eat today? I had some chips. No, I, did not, I did not eat healthy. I'll tell you that. PB&J. Uh, chippies. And uh, that's it. A glass of milk. Just like one cup. Nothing too crazy. No, nothing over the top, you know. But last night... There's Runo. Uh, last night, I went on a two and a half hour... It was about a two and a half hour bike ride when I was said and done. Eh, two, two hours, 15 minutes. Nice signature, bro. Nice signature. Who is that? Who's this lazy dude? Bride's gown. Eric, geez, just just champs. You don't you don't have a signature. You just throw the Watsy logo on there. Cool identity, bro. Cool, dude. Okay. Uh, yeah, I burned nine hundred sixty-seven calories on that two and a half hour bike ride. Now, mind you, it really I would I didn't go nonstop for two and a half hours. We stopped uh, for probably about 45 of those minutes. But the rest of the time, we were on the move. You know, that's, that's a lot. So, decent amount of calories burned in that time. Um, it felt good, you know. Dorothea showing up again. Bada bing. Wedding invitation. If anyone gets married in the Northeast Ohio area, I want to come to your wedding. Send me an invitation. I will show up. I'll bring a hot date. We'll have some fun. Okay. I want to have some fun and go out. I want to dance and move. It's got to be like a, a, in the Northeast Ohio area. Can't be too far out. So very narrow demographic there. But, you know, if you get married, Joey Moss will come and hang out. And what? hold on. What the heck is that? I don't, I don't think I've ever seen this before. Evolving Wilds. Sacrifice Evolving Wilds. Search your library for a basic land card. Put it on the battlefield. Tap and shovel. What the? That is Busted. Seriously? That's a fetch in common. What were they thinking? Like, that's going to change things, man. Oh, my God. I've never seen that, so I know that's the first time they printed that. Holy crap. Okay. Okay. All right. That is nuts, man. Lance of the Lost, too. Well, look at all this. Look at, he's got to look at all that, you know? Oh, man. Okay. <laughs> I feel good. After we pulled that Evolving Wilds, whoa. Rend Flash, destroy target non-spirit creature. Cost three. We went backwards for that. Sorry, guys. Sorry, I got so excited because of that uh, that new card. All right. Let's keep it going. <sighs> All right. Henrika. You think they would have mixed it up, you know? <laughs> I'm like yelling. You think they would have mixed it up a little bit? Give us a different mythic besides Dorethi every freaking time, but no! Just give us countless Dorethias. Dude, at the end of this, 
We're gonna have like a hundred thousand Zarethias. Oh my God! It's Domnathia, stupid! It's Domnathy. You're not even saying it right still. You tried four times. Um, we got Begulior and Cult of the Waxing Moon. Oh, look at that sick art. That's pretty cool. All right. Holy crap! Back to back, Henrikas. <laughs> Unbelievable. Okay, look at this. Hot to trot. Bam, what's gravy? Oh, get a load of that face. <laughs> She's getting all seriously. What the hell? Oh, my God. Oh, 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 that's scary, dude. Oh, my God, that's scary looking. Yeah, that's really freaking scary looking. Okay, 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 okay. Let's pull some fire, baby. Pull some fire. There's Edgar showing up. With the Paladin. Okay, nothing special there. No fire. But wow. Still another showcase box. Gotta really wonder the value. Um, depending, if this box is really good or the following one, I'll do prices. We'll see which one. I mean, they're both good. I think people would like to have either or of these. But I feel like we have cornered the showcase rare and mythic uh, uh, market. You know, like... I mean, the six boxes in total. I'm done with all six of these boxes in total. The number of showcase rare and mythic cards we pulled out probably compares to that which you would find scattered in about like 30, no, maybe like 60 set booster boxes. And we did it, look at this back to back. We did it in the matter of freaking six boxes. What you would find in probably 50 to 60. That's, that's maybe actually, probably, maybe a hundred. I mean, maybe a hundred, like, to be honest, guys. Probably a hundred. Maybe even more than that. I don't even know. It's, it's freaking crazy, okay? It really is crazy uh, that we're doing this. This is crazy. This is showcase, showcase. No showcase. Katilda, but we pulled Katilda. Some of the broken shuffler, man. Skull, skull, cap. Um, there you go. Skull, skull scabby. Oh, man. What about us? I don't know why I had Michael Jackson in my head. I don't know, man. It was weird. Okay. I was watching this. Uh, it was like just some random thing. I don't know if it was on TikTok or where it was. It was somewhere, though. Uh, and it was just... Uh, well, that's cool. Reduced to memory. Um, it was uh, Michael Jackson. And he's singing on this like 50-foot platform or something. You know, It's like moving some weird stuff. And uh, this kid... There you go. Serene Sunset. That's beautiful. Look at that art. Really cool. Um, this this uh, this fan of his, I think it was like a 20-year-old look like at least, just runs up, man. He, run, he climbs the whole freaking thing and just, you know, just hugs Jackson up there and he's all like like screaming and looking back into the crowd. I'm sure that was like 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 the best moment of this guy's life. I mean, that, that would be pretty impressive, you know. Um, don't believe everything you hear in the media. I don't believe that weird stuff that Michael Jackson did. Uh, I think, you know, I don't, I don't know why those rumors all spread like that, but really disturbing you know i don't think any of that ever happened um i just think he was a kid at heart you know um weird you know hanging out with all the little kids and stuff but dude he missed out on his whole childhood man he missed out on his childhood because of his dad his dad just pushed him and pressured him you know and just worked him like a freaking slave dude and uh oh that's cool art and uh yeah it's just i don't know it's just sad it's kind of sad what happened to him you know Got kind of weird. Um, but uh, his music, man, amazing, you know. We'll live on forever, you know. As long as there's humans on Earth, you know, we're going to be listening to some Michael Jackson here and there. Um, not something I go out of the way to listen to. I think I listened to it a bit more um, maybe like five to ten years ago. I'd say is when I listened to more Michael Jackson, you know. Not a lot of it, but when it's on the radio, you know, I'll, I'll let the song play out. But it was the coolest thing. This fan just runs up this huge uh, like scaffold or whatever that Jackson's standing on. And uh, got his hands up in the air. And he's just like screaming with him. There's Runo. Oh, cranial plating. Wow, look at that. <laughs> That's pretty hot. That's a throwback. I like that one. That was a nice little pull. Unexpected. It'd be cool if that was a spoil, though. I know. We always want more. <laughs> but yeah, highlight of that guy's life. It just And it, it just looks so powerful, you know. And Michael Jackson's like... He's holding on to him because he doesn't want the guy to freaking fall to his death, you know. So he's holding on to him while he's singing. And and Jackson doesn't miss a beat, man. 
this guy like knocks Michael Jackson's uh, microphone, like almost like it, it, I will. He knocks it out of position, uh, and Jackson just calmly, while still singing and carrying those freaking tunes, man, just keeps the show going. It was really cool. It was a cool moment. Oh, I thought I'd show that with you guys. It's pretty neat. Um, let's keep it trucking, baby. Find some freaking dough. We got Dorethia again. And Skulking Killer. You know, at this point, it's almost getting old. Seeing all this. And I'm not looking forward to opening a set booster box now. You know why? Because it's not going to be like this ever again. <laughs> I will never open a box. Oh, I got one more after this. There's Jacob. I will never crack a box like this after this next box <laughs> ever again. It just won't happen. It just won't happen. <clears throat> I I'd say one in probably 5,000 boxes are going to be like this. Now, I know you're like, one in 5,000, Joey. You just opened six in a row or five in a row. Well, that's right. Uh, but, you know, um, it's very freaking rare, man. That'll happen, so... Yeah, a really rare, man. Um, yeah, so there might be like one case, per, like in, and like on average in each state, maybe. I don't, I don't know. Honestly, I really don't know. This is all a guess. I got no effing clue what I'm even talking about right now. I gotta be honest with you. <laughs> I don't got a freaking clue. This old nut stain. I got no clue, man. There's Edgar. Sure, I'm the groom. Oh, wrong pile. There we go. Edgar's awakening foil. Down to our last two packs. We do have the box topper. I'm, I'm counting as a pack. Hopefully we get a nasty little box topper here. Nice little foil swamp. Here we go, guys. What's it going to be? Bam. Runo Stormkirk showing up again. Which spore crawler. Oh, sweet. Uh, there's the moon kraken. Okay. This was, I think, one of our weaker boxes um, out of the, the, the six so far. We have one more after this to go. Here's the box topper. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Does that sound lame when I say that? Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for watching my crap. Thanks for appreciating my work. Thanks for participating with me. Oh, damn you. Oh, what do we got here? What do we got here? We got a card that we got to be really careful with. Boop, 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 boop. Oh, my goodness. You don't see that every day. Friends of Darkest Night. That art is sick. Beautiful, beautiful card. Wow. The Three Weird Sisters. Second time we pulled you. How about that? <laughs> I'm Joey Moss, Bad Boy MTG. Get the hell out of here. I love you, baby. Thanks for tuning in. Check out these other videos. A lot of fun craziness, man. Yeah.